I'm back, and uh, it's a lot of shit that's, that just hit me. Um, I be strolling on Facebook, and I be seeing a lot of stuff, and I'm just lost with people, man, when it comes to social media. Like, why do people only, like, it's, it's just lost, man. People are only attracted to drama. Drama. You know, you could be a person that that get on social media and uh, post about how highly happy and, and, and grateful you is for waking up, you know, how blessed you is, and also speaking up on, on wisdom and knowledge, you know, sharing it with people. And really nobody will support you. Will not support you. But if you upload a video of someone fighting or fucking or somebody getting raped, you'll fucking go viral. I'm just, I mean, this shit, this, this world we live in is fucking crazy, man. You know? And the first thing that I want to let, let y'all know, man, through my little video is, you know, with, with us color people, you know, you know, we don't support each other enough to uh, get the credit we deserve, you know, it's, it's, it's just too much black on black hate, too much black on black crime, you know, and, and I just don't understand, like, why is everyone attracted to bullshit, this goes back to my other videos, you know what I'm saying, when it comes to this music, like, y'all gotta be careful what you listen to, like, people don't wanna listen to nothing that, that touches the soul, everybody wanna be riled up, you know what I'm saying, so, it's, it's fucked up, man, and especially when it comes to my own black people, black relationships, you know, we sit around and bash each other, and say the, the most hurtful things to try to grab a hold to somebody and break them down, you know what I'm saying, like, people don't even talk over stuff no more, you know what I'm saying, it's, you know, the black population is, 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 is just really fucked up, you know what I'm saying, and we can't knock these white folks for looking at some type of way and, and, and things like that, because we, we paint the picture for that, you know what I'm saying, and they go to the social media, you know, y'all don't really use social media how y'all really should be used now. You know what I'm saying? We could use this this fucking social media, man, as a weapon. It's to, instead of every time you see somebody on the ground dying, breathing in their last breath, pulling out your phone, going live. For what? For anything, if you're going to pull your phone out and go live, to have a story with it. You know what I'm saying? Show, show your effort of you trying to help that person, lift that person up, make sure that person is okay. Why just pull your phone out when somebody on the ground messed up? Or why pull your phone out when you see somebody fighting and getting jumped? Now, y'all people do the dumbest shit, man. You know? And I'm not, I'm not trying to exclude, you know what I'm saying, the Caucasians. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying that you don't really see them doing that type of shit, even though, you know, a lot of them do messed up crimes and, and things like that too, but us as black people, we tear each other down to the soul, man, to the soul, even family members, even freaking family members, man, you know, it's, you know, you know, it's real bad when, when family members try to tear you down, when family members don't want to see you climbing or trying to get somewhere in your life, that's bad. You know, we supposed to unite, man. We supposed to embrace each other, man. All y'all people, man, y'all got these phones and shit, man. Do y'all even do the history? Do y'all even look up the background of your ancestors and see the things that they went through for us to have the freedom that we have now? I gotta stop tearing each other down, man. Start lifting each other up. And then if you see somebody on social media like Facebook, you know, and we all know Facebook is just a trash app. You know, you can get a lot of information off, off of Facebook, man. Like, anything you want to know is freaking on Facebook, man. You know, but when you're trying to inspire people, especially if you're somebody that's like me, you know what I'm saying, that, that come from the projects, that come from the the, 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 the low end of the city and, and, and trying to build something, you know, hoping that 
that I can put my word out there that can probably inspire a lot of folks. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody got their own story to tell. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got their own story to tell. Everybody have their own trials and tribulations they went through in their life. Everybody dealt with their own demons. You know what I'm saying? So all, ain't there, there's nothing wrong with having an ear for the next person, man. You feel me? Or trying to support the next person. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to do it because I know you. I don't even have to know you to show you love. I'm going to show you love just off the strength. That's just me. And it should also be you. Dog, man, stop tearing each other down, man. It's, it's just horrible. And to you ladies, y'all don't know how bad y'all make yourself look. You belittle yourself. No one, I mean, a real man don't care about ass and titties and 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 how good you can suck a cock or lick a woman ass crack. Don't no real man care for that. Y'all open up the door for the bullshit that, that y'all go through. You know what I'm saying? You put on tight clothes and you taking pictures and shit like that. You at a club or you on a fucking stripping pole. And then hours later or shall I say a day later, you making a post about men in your inbox. I mean, you, you seeking for the wrong attention. You know, y'all bring this on yourself, man. You know, and to the fellas, you know what I'm saying? You don't have to always be little a woman, especially a black woman. Stop it. And let me rewind that to you black women. Stop trying to be little black men. You know, you, you don't have to do that. If a person did you some type of way, oh, just let it be. You know, you don't have to fight a person with words, uh, come back with something that you know that's going to really hurt that person. Feel it. You don't have to do that, man. I mean, you know, this is just the way how I look at stuff. You know what I'm saying? When I get mad at a person, of course, yeah, I hold grudges. I'm not going to bring that pain into the next day. You know, I may just still be a little off or whatnot, but I'm not going to, I'm not just going to keep, you know what I'm saying? For anything, you know what I'm saying, my heart going to turn back to the same way how it's supposed to be, and I'm going to show you the genuine love you deserve to get. You know, and this is something that I also don't understand, you know. Now, I used to use the Facebook app, and, you know, I used to try to put words out there, you know, speaking on my family, speaking on just, just, just things that I know that I can't change. And, you know, relationships, you know, stuff like that. And I find out, like, man, it's just a waste of time. It's really a waste of time. So why talk about somebody on social media and you 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 posting your thoughts on a site where there's millions and billions of people and half of these people don't even fucking know you. You know, a lot of people use Facebook just to you know the the attention seeking, you know. Me personally, I just want to inspire people. You know what I'm saying? Coming from the rooter to the toot, you know what I'm saying? I don't have to have no 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 high quality video. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing this straight from my phone and I'm letting y'all know how I feel. You know what I'm saying? Whether people listen to me or pay attention to me or not, you know what I'm saying? We gotta start loving each other, man. We have to start loving each other, man. You gotta start having a heart. You can't always think in the dark. You know, start uplifting people, man. If you see somebody that's 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 trying to inspire you or saying something good, show that person some love, man. Don't stroll past nobody and you see somebody talking about somebody got shot over here or, 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 or uh, John Doe over here got killed and, you know, people just going crazy. You know, it's like y'all seek for the wrong attention, man. It's crazy. And half of y'all that be sitting out here so nosy into other people's business, y'all know this person. That just got killed. Or or know this person that just went to jail. And you know what this person is doing. You know the lifestyle this person is living. But yet you still haven't left the hand out. You haven't tried to pull this person to the side and holler at them. Like, look, man, you should. You know, maybe you should do this this way. Or you got kids. You know, think for your kids. You know what I'm saying? Let y'all y'all let it go on and go on and go on. And then, you know, as soon as something happens, it's, oh, well, I love this person. He was such a good person. He was such a... You know what I'm saying? This is crazy, man. Y'all got to think right, man. Think right. Start helping a person, man. If you know you can help this person, man. If you know, even if you know it's not going to even seek in this person's brain, still put that word out there. Because you never know what he might not catch today, he will catch tomorrow. No, that's, 
that's that's just how I look at stuff, y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's just as my thought on a lot of stuff, you know. To my black people, man, stop tearing each other down, y'all. Come on, man, that's enough of this going on. Chicago, like, it's, it's just crazy. Black on black crime. Off the meter. Pure Illinois. Small city compared to Chicago. Crime raped in Scott. I'm talking about Scott it. Black on black crime. And then when the police end up killing somebody, everybody, oh, the police this, the police that. Okay, I'm against that also. But in the process, let's try to help these young brothers and sisters, man, before they end up being another one of them statistics. And then, like, people wait to the last minute to try to protest. Let's not do that. Let's do this every day. Even if we can't do it every day, let's fucking make a website. Let's fucking use this social media and try to, try to man, just, just, just come up with a group. We can use this social media to help each other, man. To help each other, especially if you got a story to tell, especially if you've been to hell and back, you know, and that's what I want to do. You know, I've been falsely accused of crimes that I didn't do. I've been falsely accused of stuff I was supposed to be said. That's not true. And I live with it. But guess what? I keep my head up high. You know, I'm a man of God now. You know what I'm saying? I don't roll with the mob. I don't, I don't hang with no one. All I want to do is inspire my people. If I can. And you shall too. So with that said, man, to all my colored people, white people, Latinos, whatnot, whoever see this video, man, if you could help the next, help that person, man. If you see somebody slipping, get them. Cuff them up, man. Talk to them. Don't wait to the last minute. Let's just stop doing that. Stop waiting to the last minute. Use this social media app that they give us, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, whatever you do. Use it to help people, man, to reach people, to touch people. It might not start off how you want it, but God doggone it, man, it's going to get somewhere, man. It's going to get somewhere, and people going going to hear you. So let's do this, man. Rio 100 coming at you. Stay blessed.